Hi, welcome to this video. In this video, I will show you how you can add comments to your JavaScript code. Comments are very important. It helps to explain your JavaScript code and make it more readable. There are two ways of adding comments to JavaScript code. The first one is adding comments as single line comment and the second one is adding comments as multi line comments. Let me show you how you can add single line comments to your JavaScript code. I have this index.html file and inside that I have included or linked external JavaScript file. This is the external JavaScript file. Let me add single line comments to this external JavaScript file. The single line comment starts with double forward slashes and the comments after that. This is single line comment. Any text between the forward double slashes and the end of the line is ignored by the JavaScript. This line will be not executed by JavaScript engine. Let me write a simple JavaScript statement alert. This is, let us say, I just root single line comment. Let me save this myscript.js file. And let us see the result of this inside the browser. I will open the index.html file. So you see the JavaScript statement is executing but there is no such execution of this line. So this is the comments. So this way we write single line comments. The second way is to add comments as multi-line. The multi-line comments start with forward slash and star and ends with star and forward slash. Any text between these will be ignored by JavaScript engine. Let me write some multi-line comments. This is multi-line comment and it will be ignored by JavaScript engine. So these lines will be ignored by JavaScript engine and it will never be executed. Let me write a JavaScript statement. Let us say document dot write and inside that I will write I just root multi line comment. Let me save this myscript.js file and let me open the index.html file in the browser so we can see the result. I will open the index.html file. This is the alert box which is coming from this JavaScript statement, this one. And when I click on the OK, this is the result of document.write. So you don't see any comments on this page. So comments are totally ignored by the JavaScript engine. And this is the way to write the single line comment. And this is the way to write the multi line comments. Another benefit of using comment is you can prevent the execution of JavaScript code. For example, if I add double slashes in front of this line of code, this line of code will become comment. You can see it and it will be ignored by the JavaScript engine. Let me save it and show you the result inside the browser. And if you refresh this, now you can see only the result of alert box and there is no result of document dot write. So by using comments, you can also prevent the execution of any JavaScript statement. It is a good practice to add comments to your project to make it more readable for the other developers. So always add comments to your JavaScript code.